Hi everyone, hopefully you're back on our live feed. Um, Shaman White Eagle, if you're still live, can you let everyone know to go back to Facebook Live on our page to head back into the church for our last part of service? Can you please have everyone who's watching you right now come back to First Spiritualist Church page? Can you have everyone go back to the Facebook page for our church so that they can watch the rest of the service? to come back. Um, I really like what um, my Shaman Eagle was talking about with karma. There's so much survival that's happening right now and protection that's happening right now. We're trying to protect ourselves. We're, a lot of us are in survival mode. <clears throat> and we kind of wonder, well, why is all this happening? What's up with this karma? But the thing about karma, at least for me personally, what I want to share with you as the lecture leader is the positivity and the power of karma. I make sure that I personally do three hours of service once a week. I drink my water. I try to get good sleep or at least a nap in. I meditate a little bit and I exercise. <laughs> I do meditate every day, but it's just like a little bit goes a long way. And since we're in our homes, you know, and we're, we're wondering how can we be of service, you can be of service to yourself. You can actually take this time to self-care. Yeah. Call somebody. Or if you have the technology, FaceTime somebody or Zoom. You know, or if you don't know, find somebody that knows how to do that so that you can be in the moment with them. Be in the moment with yourself. I took this time yesterday to mow my lawn because I live behind a house and next to another house. And it felt so good to just be in my yard. And when I was in my yard, I was thinking about every single person. And this is how I was of service. I was thinking about every single person stuck in their apartment afraid to open up their window and I was breathing in the grass and I was using my shoulders to push the machine and I just envisioned a little apartment and I envisioned a person in there and I just envisioned all this love being sent to them because that's all I can do right now in quarantine right after I leave here I'm gonna go back to my house and being of service is in so many different ways an amazing form of karma. So don't feel like you're helpless, okay? You can get your life how you want it to be. I think Reverend Lorena said something about you are what you become, or you become what you are now. And I feel really proud because every Friday I am giving three hours online to help members of my choir that are elderly and they can't leave and they've had health stuff and just like make them feel good and we're all singing together. So why don't you pull up a YouTube, do some karaoke with yourself, pull out that coloring book that you haven't done in a while. I mean, we're gonna be in our homes. So why not utilize this time for yourself to do some yoga. I mean, call somebody. Okay, one more thing before we finish up because I just want to make sure everybody has time to get back to our page. Yesterday, I saw this. <clears throat> There was an older woman. She went to call her daughter. She called the wrong phone number. And another older woman answered. And both of them were quarantined, alone, sad, and lonely. Well, they started talking, and they started bonding, and they ended up exchanging their phone numbers and hanging out. So you never know 
how human connection can occur. And sometimes you just need to let it occur within yourself. Take a step back from all those negative posts and the conspiracy theories, because you go down that rabbit hole. But why don't you instead just be in your own personal space, enjoy what your personal energy feels like, and do something that makes you feel whole. Because I'm about to do that with these two gentlemen. We're about to sing and dance and have a lot of fun. So hopefully you guys are here. Uh, thank you for coming back. And we want to thank you, Shaman and Mighty Eagle, once again, for bringing us into the present moment, for honoring everything, the good, the bad, the hauntingly beautiful, and surrounding us in love. Thank you, thank you, thank you, on behalf of our church. Gracias.
dress one day from my infinite sadness you came and brought me love again you go, I will go make you stay, because love is the saddest thing, when it goes away, because love is the saddest thing.
you all. We love you. Thank you, Kaya. And Jimmy Keys, Jimmy Garen on piano, and all you percussionists out there. Yes, we love you. We love you.
who is making the effort to give the love out in any way we can. And oh my gosh, speaking of giving, the convention center is open and you can drive through and get food. Yes. And there are people that are just dropping flowers on doorsteps. So think about all this goodness and soak yes. it in because we have all this good energy in our church. And keep going and yeah. just keep giving the good. Good, good, good. And oh, amazing, amazing musicians. I know that my heart is in song. lockdown thing so that we can come together and care for all of you so yes yeah. safely, safely very safely and um, on behalf of all of us here in first spiritualist church please like share subscribe um, expand 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 and let's get this out there let's raise the vibration of the mother earth of spirit of self Let's um, and change the likes on Facebook to love because we're about love, right? That's right. That's right. Love, like, share, give, and have a beautiful week. Again, if you have any concerns or any needs, please don't hesitate to call or email and reach out to First Spiritualist Church. No matter what it is, we'll do whatever we can to lead you in the right direction or help you. And... Thank you, Kaya, Olivia, for being here and walking us through this beautiful service. God bless you all. Love and light. What happens to the little boy who farts in church? What? He sits in his own pew. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Are you still recording? No. Love blast. Love blast. Well, luckily I have it on super close. Oh, it's all up in the nose? The whole time I'm thinking. Oh, goodness. Bats in the cave. You were right on time. I want to be right on time.